Alright, so I'm going to add Thermal Grizzly. It's a good thermal paste, one of the top rated, and it's uh, non-conductive. So then you don't got to worry about any overflow, any spillage over onto the circuitry. So I'm going to add a generous amount just to make sure I cover this whole processor. Got a lot of cards running, got some, uh, got to make sure we're good for heat, so. Alright, now I'm going to put it back together. Just realign all the uh, screw holes. Alright, so first you'll put in this bottom screw uh, that goes under the plate. This kind of helps align all the holes. Uh, makes it way easier to screw in and know that you have an even pressure. I actually like this addition. It's a good idea. Yeah, now everything's nice and aligned. We'll start our four. I didn't lock it down, I just got it hand tight so you can kind of pivot off of it. But as you're screwing it up, watch the holes and make sure they all align nice. Get them all hand tight. Alright. And I'm going to throw the back plate on. Magnetize the tip of the screwdriver. Okay, now, for your four long ones, you'll kind of have to align to your base like any of the other sapphire nitros. But really, once you get them all lined up, they kind of go in pretty, pretty smooth. Just tighten everything down and you're good to go. I don't push very hard for these ones. Just need to hand tight. Alright, and that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.